Welcome back to my final morning watch house appraisal video on Friday the 2nd of September with me Richard Perry Market Analyst at Hantech Markets looking at gold and um, we've got a bit of a consolidation pretty much across the markets really um, but gold is holding on to this sort of this level that I've been talking about 1306 and um, this old breakout level 1306 and it sort of hit a low yesterday of 130190 and rallied and that rally came on the back of the dollar weakness on the back of the ISM data. And we're holding on to this level. And we're also holding on to the uptrend. That uptrend comes in around 12.95. Um, and momentum, momentum indicators are sort of slightly settling. It's it's very interesting. I think this payroll support could be very um, could be pivotal for this gold chart, actually, uh, near term. Uh, a strong dollar or um, any sort of strong payroll support really would that would suggest possibility of september being on the table again um would drive a strong dollar and pull gold lower um and a, a lower move on gold below 1300 really um would sort of op open uh, further corrective move a breakdown of that um of, of that uptrend would also um drive that move um you've got minor support that comes in around 1280 but generally speaking around sort of 1260, 1250, 1260 is the sort of the main line of support that comes in. So you've got basically um, the prospect of a, a corrective move, really, if you get a strong payroll support today. Um, and you could see a, a breakdown of the, uh, the the strong bullish argument. Um, wouldn't turn You wouldn't turn necessarily bearish argument. You'd sort of lose that bullish argument. But for now, we are holding on to 1306. Near term, you'd be thinking 1315 to 1325 is your resistance span. 1315. 1315, 1316 has been sort of a, a bit of a an old support becomes new resistance in the last couple of days. Uh, also, a breakout above 1316 would complete a little bit of a base pattern with uh, left hand shoulder, head, right hand shoulder. Uh, and you'd measure 1301, say 1302 really, to 1316, which is 14 bucks, projected high at 1330. You'd also challenge this 1325 resistance. Again, old, uh, old support is new resistance. This is 1325. It's a bit of an old pivot level. Um, so, a few levels there on the uh, on the hourly chart that you can look at. But certainly, I think a, a move above 1325 would be uh, sort of re returning to a more bullish outlook, really, on gold near term. But um, the the reaction of the sort of support around 1300 to 1310 has been relatively positive so far. Uh, just need, I think, the um, uh, a sort of um, maybe an inline pale support would sort of be relatively supportive for gold, but I think more to the fact that a weak pale support would be um, would be positive for gold. So I wish you good luck in your trading today on gold. Don't forget my pales webinar at one fifteen. You can still sign up to it on uh, Hantech Markets website. Thank you very much, and I'll speak to you later. Thank you.